Hey, this is Matt Storm, Guns N' Roses, Velvet Revolver, The Cult, now Kings of Chaos. Thanks for tuning in, and please donate to Sweet Relief for musicians and music industry workers that are in need right now with this downtime. And I uh, hope to see you all out there again real soon. Miss ya. Keep rocking. Hello and welcome to the Klipsch Keepers' of Sound event. We're here tonight not just to enjoy some music and some art and get to know some people that you may not know, but we really need to raise awareness about the hardships that musicians and music industry workers are going through right now. It's not enough just to raise the awareness, we also need to raise some money tonight and we look forward to you helping us with this. My name is Paul Jacobs. I'm the President and Chief Executive Officer of Klipsch Audio. For the past 75 years, following in our founders' footsteps, we've tried to deliver that power, detail, and emotion that you only experience in the live music venues. We all need live music in our lives. If you think about it, live music inspires us. It feeds our soul. And at a time like this, it unites us. It may be a while before you have an opportunity to see your favorite artist live again. So we ask a few of our friends to play for you tonight and not only help bring awareness to this, but also to provide some funds for the musicians and the music industry workers until they're able to get back on the road again. We're collecting donations for the Sweet Relief COVID-19 Fund. It's designed to help the musicians and music industry workers that are so hard hit right now. The great thing about tonight is not only the artists that you're going to meet, the music that you hear, but Klipsch is going to match your donations to give these folks some relief until they're able to work again. We'd like to thank all the artists that participated tonight, but not only that, all of the folks that helped put this show together. We think it is important as a community that we support live music and that we support the people that deliver the entertainment and the art that moves our lives on a daily basis. I'd like to thank all of you for joining us tonight. Remember, stay healthy, stay safe, and never stop rocking. Nonprofit organization that provides relief and assistance to musicians and music industry workers who are struggling right now going through a hard time due to illness, disabilities, or age-related problems. It's such an important cause, and I think people don't realize how few resources musicians actually have. And if some sort of accident or tragedy were to arise, it's not like a corporation where you can go to them for help. I have a few friends who have benefited significantly from Sweet Relief. We fully support everything that Sweet Relief backs. Sweet Relief! Oh yeah! So I had the good fortune of meeting our first artist in the fall of 2014 in Nashville, Tennessee. I was down there for Petty Fest and it's kind of an incredible event where all of the great musicians from Nashville get together to honor the great, late great Tom Petty. Um, Black Keys, Civil Wars, Kings of Leon, Little Feathers, the list went on. 
But the thing that struck me about that night is the guitar player that was sort of the quasi house band guitar player stole the show from all of them. So all night long I'm trying to find out who this is and it turns out it's Mr. Butch Walker. I did some research that night and I found out a lot about him. And by the time the weekend was over, I'd made him my friend. And we're still friends to this very day. He is a passionate artist and producer. He just dropped his latest record, American Love Story, which is an extraordinary piece of art that really reflects who he is as a man and an artist. I am proud to call him my friend. So will you welcome, from Malibu, California and Nashville, Tennessee, my good friend, Mr. Butch Walker. Hey, what's up? My name is Butch Walker, and uh, I'd like to thank Klipsch Audio for having me on here on this uh, streaming event. Uh, I did a Keepers of the Sound uh, video uh, installment for them uh, a year or two ago. It was a while back, and um, it was a lot of fun, and they're an incredible company, and this event uh, is no exception as we are hoping to get uh, whatever donations that people can afford to do during this time uh, because what we want to do is we're trying to help out uh, musicians that uh, are in need. So uh, we are thinking of fellow musicians in need and encouraging that help by donating so that uh, Sweet Relief's COVID-19 fund um, will help out uh, music and industry workers. So uh, Klipsch will also match every donation dollar for dollar. So, um, you know, give what you can in this crazy time if you can. Uh, in the meantime, uh, I'm going to play a couple songs for you. This is uh, a song I wrote for a musical, like a rock opera that I have coming out called American Love Story uh, very shortly. And funny enough, I was working on the music to this when I did the Keepers of the Sound um, for the video I did for Klipsch a while back. So they actually got a chance to hear the music to this song. Um, but uh, it's, it's done now, so I'm gonna play it for you. This is called Out in the Open. Two, three. I remember in my younger years Walking to a city pool Guy yelled and caught a faggot From this kid I knew in school His dad and dad before him Grew up outside of town With a lack of education Yeah, the options weren't around Sometimes I'd see that boy in class With bruises on his eyes Red and pretty swollen, tears tangled up in pride. Repeating memorized rhetoric about it being God's way. If I don't follow the good book, then there'll be some hell to pay. I don't blame you how you turn out, a habit's hard to break. You were born into what you became, and I was born this way. I can try to show compassion. Before you take that shot Out here in the open Whether I like it or not Driving home from a party With friends on a Saturday night I came upon a wreckage in The coldest part of night the boy they call me faggot, like bleeding almost dead. Yeah, he wrecked that truck from drinking and the windshield made his head. Well, I pulled him from the driver's seat, said help was on its way. Put my hands up upon his head and said it would be okay. When he focused on my likeness, I could see it in his eyes. Everything he taught to hate will finally save his life And the irony about this I told him with a smile Yeah, your God must work in stranger ways Than your heart will allow Well, he caught his breath between the tears 
eyes bloodshot and dim Rebel flag tattooed hand holding mine to him He said, please don't blame me for how I turned out I learned a little late You were born into as our day came And I was born this way I could try to show compassion It might be all I got Out here in the open Whether I like it or not I'm going to play a song off of an album I did called Afraid of Ghosts, and this song is um, called 21 and Over. Taking memories to the trash 21 and over, yeah, it happens real fast Ooh, 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 ooh. Well, we had our first baby and I spent my last dime Trying to keep him from growing out of clothes and out of time Sitting after my Shift the drinks are free, but I'm not Daddy, what will I be if I ever grow up? Can I get out of a town that drowns everything I love? Come hell or high water See where I went wrong Getting lost inside the words of my own song Yeah, life is too short For who I long to be Daddy, what will I be? If I ever grow up Can I get out of a town That drowns everything I know Come hell or high water Gonna leave here When I'm sober Don't wanna be 21 and over Oh Thanks a lot for having me, Klipsch. Uh, my name is Butch Walker. Take care.
From Ludlow, Kentucky, please welcome Americana Indie Rockers, the Harmed Brothers. When I saw them in the Whispering Beard Folk Festival, they stole the show. Ray Vietti and Alex Salcido are talented musicians and kindred spirits. They bring back the lost art of storytelling that today's music most desperately deserves. Here's the Harmed Brothers. Hey, what's up? This is Ray with the Harmed Brothers. Uh, I'm happy to be a part of this event. Uh, I'm just sitting around here thinking about how we, none of us can go on tour anymore. So really feeling for all of the uh, musicians out there in the world that are stuck at home and not able to do what they love doing. So I see a lot of uh, online stuff and I've participated in some of it myself. So and I live here in Ludlow, Kentucky, uh, and uh, it's about going on tour and, and coming back home to, the, to see the person that you love. And so I know a lot of us can have that same situation going on. So. Uh, anyway. Coat by the door. 
Try my best not to wake you I don't think I ever missed you more In a river town outside the city In a river town divided the east states In a river town where you and I feel the same And I hope we always feel this way yeah, I hope we always feel this way And I hope we always feel this way I feel for everybody out there. I hope you enjoyed it. You can stream these, uh, stream these tunes on any of your streaming platforms and pick up a Harm Brothers record if you... If you like any of it, I know my uh, brother and Alex is going to play a few tunes for you too, so... Thanks a lot, everybody, and uh, stay safe. We'll see you out there one day. Um, so if we've never met before, uh, I, I am one half of a band called the Harmed Brothers. Harmed Brothers. We were supposed we're putting a record out this year, and we we're supposed to tour and see see the country and the world and everybody that we could. And um, just like a lot of you, our plans uh, kind of got fudged with. And so now we're learning how to deal. We're learning how to adapt and live in this new life that we have right now. For a lot of mu you musicians out there, like it's it's scary, it's weird, it's rough, um, but we're all in it together. To, to steal a platitude. And with that being said, I'm gonna, I'm gonna play a song about keeping the faith, even when it's really, really hard to do so. And uh, this is uh, actually on our new record that's coming out in June. Uh, both both the songs I'm going to play are from uh, from our new record. It's called Across the Waves. Comes out in, uh, June 5th. But uh, this is for everybody that's just a little unsure. Um, it's okay to be unsure, but it's also um, it's very imperative that we uh, we keep, just we keep trying and uh, we got to stay. We have to muster up some kind of brave. So uh, this is for you. This is called Skyline Over. Watch yourself a little Jesus fetch Put it on your car and you made a wish Or a new prayer that you know by heart On a get well car and you said you hope it don't miss Before the freeway you cross your chest You cross your fingers open for the best Keep your head down, open your heart You can wash up the terror all you want Friday comes and you still lay around while you're stretched to your ten feet tall. And if you could, would you spread your wings at least as far as the county sprawls? Keep breathing till you through it all. Till you're a skyline over a small town. Till you're a skyline in the distance. Till you're all Oh
Thanks again to Klipsch, Klipsch Audio for having me, uh, Keepers of the Sound, thank you Sweet Relief, uh, thank you for all you're doing, thanks to all the wonderful essential workers out there risking everything for us so that we can um, we can ride this out and um, donate, give to the Sweet Relief Fund, help us poor musicians out, help out your fellow neighbor, do what you can. Our next guest is Garrett Dutton, a.k.a. G-Love of G-Love and the Special Sauce. I've seen him play in front of a large audience and even a small one of just 50 people, and he's got a magnetic presence and is so talented. He's performing a song from his new album, The Juice. It explores the ways that we can brighten our own worlds and the worlds of those around us, which we all need so much right now. Hey, I'm G Love, and I'm here for Keepers of the Sound, a fundraiser for Sweet Relief, and uh, thinking about all of our fellow musicians and artists out there. And thanks to you all for helping uh, to raise some money and support some of those artists. Here's one of my new songs, and this one's called Digging Roots. <laughs> A girl was by my feet, watching in the time pass Oh, I'm digging roots, I'm planting seeds, I'm loving you, loving me. I'm digging roots, digging roots, won't let them grow. I'm digging roots, I'm pulling weeds, I'm making more. Digging roots, I'm digging roots, deeper than you know. Watching the time roll back Watching the moon rising on the sea With some good friends I guess the more like family Laughing by the fire feeling high Oh, I'm digging roots, I'm past seas I'm loving you, you're loving me I'm digging roots, digging roots Gonna let them grow Guys, man, stay up.
At Klipsch, we talk a lot about the power, detail, and emotion of the live music experience and being loud and proud. This next head-banging metal and rock band, Hero Jr., has all of it. For the last decade, they've been a fierce advocate for the Klipsch brand. Please welcome the flaming ball of energy that is Hero Jr. one of the most powerful and influential drummers in the world. He has played with so many top artists in the music industry. The list is too long to go through right now, but some of them include Bob Dylan, 
Bob Seger, Skinner, Stones. Kenny is probably best known for being the powerhouse behind John Mellencamp and his band. Some of those early hits with his known fills, like Jack and Diane, where suddenly people were like, who is that? What is that, you know? So in 2001, on September 11th, the morning of, we were all together for a photo shoot. We had Kenny in the studio for our powered subwoofer line. But that morning, there were tears. But music brought us together, and yet again, we're together in these crazy times. What's interesting is music brings us together every time. And he is a dear friend, a longtime friend of Klipsch, and we consider him part of the family. I think that it's not just his drumming and his craft, but his approach to life has made him a mentor for so many people, including me. So uh, I'm very honored to introduce our friend, my friend, Mr. Kenny Aronoff. Hi, this is Kenny Aronoff, locked down and isolated in my studio in Los Angeles, Uncommon Studios LA. And I want to thank the Clips Group, who I've been associated with for over 20 years, for including me in their fundraising event called Clips Keepers of the Sound Live. Now, the purpose of this event is to help musicians in need during this COVID-19 pandemic. I, like many musicians and all the people who are involved with the live concert events all over the world, large and small, from Coachella to the small clubs and local towns everywhere, are out of work right now. So every dollar we donate will be matched by the Clips Group, which is pretty cool. So the first song I'm going to play for you is a song called Shapeshifting, off of Joe Satriani's new record called Shapeshifting. It's a song in 6-8, and it's pretty fast. It goes like this. One, two, three, four, five, six. So the second song I want to play for you is a song called The Extremist. It's not on Joe's new record, but it's definitely on the tour. This has got a very Led Zeppelin feel to it. One, two, three, four. Teardrops is a song that was probably one of the most difficult songs to record on Joe's record, mostly because it was so slow. It's, um, it's got a three feel, like a one, two, three, and it's seven groups of three through most of the song, except for the solo, where it's six groups of three. Very slow, you have to place every note exactly in the right place. One, two, three, four, five. One of the things that made this record shapeshifting really interesting to record is that every song was a different style of music. Now this song called Ala Farka Dick Dale has kind of got an Indian Latin feel to it. And it goes like this. One, two, three, four.
So the last song I'm going to play is a song that's probably one of Joe's most famous songs called Satch Boogie. And in the solo section, I do this shuffle beat with my feet. It kind of goes like this. When it comes to making great music, there's nothing more authentic than someone who writes, records, and produces their own music. And our next guest does all of that. All the way from Brooklyn, New York, please welcome J.R. Corminas. Hello, my name is J.R. Corminas. I'm from Brooklyn, New York. I'll be playing my song, Bless You. Thanks for tuning in. I ask you to please donate to Sweet Relief to help musicians and music industry workers who are in need right now. We hope to see you soon back on tour as soon as it's safe to do so. We miss you, and I know we can all get through this. There's a place where solitude meets silence. There's a place where attitude meets violence I don't wanna talk to you, so leave me alone Cause I don't need you to you, I should have known Come back to me streets are crashing markets no one cares but time will kill the sun say yeah cause the day just runs away from the truth so please don't talk to me i'm not talking to you come
Our next guest is Fing Yi, an incredibly talented ukulele player from Taiwan. He started playing at just five years old. He's performed on The Ellen Show and he has a huge following on social media. We're so honored he's here with us now. Please welcome Fing Yi. Hey guys, I'm Fang Yi. Please help musicians in need by donating to a fundraiser. Thank you.
Music and laughter both heal the soul, which is why I'm so excited about our next presenter. Don Jameson is a comedian who is also one of the co-hosts of the VH1 classic show, That Metal Show, which is legends of heavy metal come on and they talk about their music, their influences, and they just hang out. So take it away, Don. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's comedian Don Jameson. And right now I'm really thinking about all the musicians and comedians who are not able to go out and perform live. Um, so I'm going to try to give you guys a few minutes of stand up. I have no crowd in front of me. I have no brick wall behind me. Um, so hopefully you guys will fill in the laughs on your end. Um, but this will be kind of weird for me because I've never done it like this. But let's give it a shot. Um, these are very different times. I'm really, uh, I'm missing my favorite drinking buddy right now. And we all have that one friend who's always up for a cocktail, right? I always say to my buddy, hey, Rip, what time you want to start drinking on Saturday? And he'll go Thursday. That's a great drinking buddy, right? But people break your chops now about drinking. We're very politically correct. You know, people are like, oh, Don, when you drink, you make bad decisions. <laughs> yeah, pretty much what I'm trying to do when I drink is make bad decisions. I don't know anybody who ever drank a bottle of wild turkey and did their taxes afterwards. All right, Martha Stewart, apparently, but that's just one person. Yeah, a friend of mine said to me the other day, hey, Don, you should quit drinking. At least I don't wake up with a headache every morning. I'm like, I don't either. I'm a comedian. I sleep till 1230 in the afternoon. I beat the system. Now go make me a Bloody Mary. And I, But actually, I'm, I'm more of a beer drinker, and I love cheap beer, okay? I don't like any of these fancy craft beers, all right? Um, and for you people who drink cheap beer out there, keep doing it. Honestly, because here's what happens. You know, everyone's gotten so trendy. Now, you know, you're sitting at the bar drinking a Miller Lite and your buddy comes up. Oh, dude, don't drink that. That's not real beer. Come to the bar. I'm going to buy you a couple of Blue Moons. Don't do it. That, that will change you, okay? Now you're drinking Blue Moons every weekend. A month later, you, you got nothing in your bank account and you're walking around with a neck beard and a man bun. That's right. Craft beer is fertilizer for a man bun. Six months later, you're driving around in a Prius with a Vote Bernie bumper sticker, listening to Imagine Dragons on your way to a Kickstarter campaign for a gluten-free vape shop. Oh, I'm gluten-free. I'm GMO-free. You're an idiot. That's what you are. I'm going to live forever. No, you're not. You know who's going to live forever? Keith Richards is going to live forever. All right, the guy's 175 years old. He's still out rocking like a mofo, isn't he? Do you think if Keith Richards cares if the catering at a stone show is gluten-free? He's like, hey, get me a bottle of Jack Daniels and a carton of Marlboros. I'm gonna go out and play Tumble and Dice right now. But wherever you are, whatever you're doing, I hope you're enjoying, I hope you're staying safe and healthy. And I just wanna say, God bless America, right? And, and let's, let's hear it for the men and women in uniform who serve this country 24-7, 365, who wear the uniform, and you know who I'm talking about, right? The UPS delivery person. That's right. Because when I need a selfie stick, a my pillow, tea tree shampoo, and a Gwyneth Paltrow vagina candle, those are the real heroes in the United States of convenience. Hey, I'm Don Jameson. Thanks so much for listening. I hope you got a couple of laughs out of that. And uh, hopefully see you in the comedy club soon. Speaking of that metal show, our next two performers were both guests on the show and I'm excited to welcome them to the Clips Keepers of the Sound event. Both are legends in heavy metal music. Matt Sorum is in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame with Guns N' Roses and also played with the supergroup Velvet Revolver. Here he is performing Patience, which we all need right now. I'm out in the backyard here in the desert. Those are my palm trees. It's getting a little chilly, so I put on this woolly hat in tribute to Izzy Stradlin, one of the writers of this next song. 
And I was very fortunate to play my old bandmates on this song. And uh, obviously I was on drums. So <laughs> I'm going to play it for you tonight on the guitar and sing it. I hope you enjoy my version. This one's called Patience.
That was awesome. Skid Row's debut album came out when I was in the Marine Corps back in Okinawa. I know that we burned through at least a couple of cassette tapes listening to that over and over. When we got back to the US, it was everywhere. Please welcome Rob Afuso, the drummer from Skid Row and also Soul System. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. I'm Rob Afuso from Soul System and Skid Row and uh, thanks for supporting Klipsch Sweet Relief campaign to help musicians and music industry workers at this time. Uh, as you all know, we can't play for you, we can't perform live, no large gatherings, so um, it's particularly hit us all very hard, and of course with everyone else, but we, we'd love to play some music for you and do what we do, and thanks for making your donations to the cause. I'm gonna play a, a song, one of my favorite ones that I, we used to play live, uh, and I actually did play this on the recording, uh, so monkey business.
Ripe is a high energy seven piece jam band. They're part funk, part jazz, part soul. Simply put, dance music. Get on your feet for Ripe. Hi, thank you so much for tuning in. Please donate to Sweet Relief to help musicians and music industry workers that are in need in this time. We miss you guys, we love you guys, we'll see you out on the road as soon as it's safe to do so. <laughs> How's everybody doing? We hope you're doing well today. We are ripe, we're gonna play some music for you. We hope it makes the day a little bit better. Together is a fine, fine line Short in the answer, I want it Come on now, is this a good time? Ooh, what more can you do?
come out by night to mess you around and feed all right. And if you think that I sound it, I'll turn me kind of the sun. Repeat it. Things I do on this game, down in the light. Keep it real, I'll avoid your eyes. Now I'm so, you remember. Dreams are always meant to kiss fire. Our next artist is someone that I met 20 years ago, and I can safely say that she is not only my friend, but she's an inspiration. In fact, she's someone that I've asked my girls to look up to, because I believe that Ginny DeVoe is what the music industry should be. She is an absolute powerhouse vocally. She's an extraordinary songwriter. I know that two of her first records, Ta-da and Does She Walk on Water, are with me at all times. So will you welcome, please, my friend, Jenny DeVoe from Indianapolis, Indiana. Hi, I'm Jenny DeVoe. I'm going to do a song that I wrote for you. This is called Blue Sky, Big Sun. Perhaps you are bright side of the moon or the melody of some old song too but I don't care where you go away no no long as you take me with you So why we war with one another? You know, having fun it used to feel so much better. Now being alone feels just like being together. So let's make it better. If we can see all you need is a sky, big sun. No, it sounds simple, but it sure sounds fun. You don't always have to blame someone. If you got yourself a blue sky.
something you can't explain It curls up under your skin And it drives you half insane And you wanna scream it out But you don't know its name That she's just, just so starving for hunger again Guess you're starving for hunger Guess all you need is a blue sky, big sun. A noise sounds simple, but it sure sounds fun. You don't always have to please someone. Cause you got yourself a blue sky. You got yourself a big sun. Sounds simple, but it sure sounds fun. You don't always have to blame someone if you got yourself a blue sky. A blue sky, be That's Blue Sky Big Sun, and that's a little song I wrote. My name's Jenny DeVoe. I want to thank Clipsh Audio for uh, including me in just their life and their world for so many years. I've done some really cool things with them, and uh, they're a good company. They're a good bunch of people because people are what makes up a company. I love that they're involved with Sweet Relief. And um, I want to thank Sweet Relief for all the stuff that they're doing for musicians in need. So. Um, Thank you, I wanna thank Klipsch, and I just wanna um, thank Sweet Relief too, and um, peace to everybody. My name's Jenny DeVoe. Please come find me on Facebook and uh, my website too, which is jennydevoe.com. Peace and love. The next artist is carving out his own path in Nashville. He's a talented singer-songwriter with a fresh perspective on Americana's country roots. Please welcome Ray Remington.
Our next performer, all of you will know him as the lead singer of the Spin Doctors. However, me and Chris got introduced by a mutual friend, Seth Frank, a couple years back, the night before the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame induction ceremony. We had a long night. We had a fun night. I got to know him as an incredibly gracious and kind man. And I'm very fortunate to introduce him as our next performer. Please consider donating to our Sweet Relief fundraiser. Chris Barron, just go ahead now. Hey, this is Chris Barron from Spin Doctors, Eclipse speaker user since the late 20th century, encouraging you to give to musicians in need in this crazy, crazy time. Um, the Eclipse Sweet Relief COVID-19 Fund, and here's a tune you might have heard. This one got a princely racket. What I said now, got some seal up on his jacket. Ain't hey, let's head now, you may ram him. Your father will come down you. How about that now, you may ram me. Your father will disown you. How about that now, you may ram him. I'm me ram me. I'm the one that love it, baby. Can't you see? I ain't got no future. I'm feeling a tree, but I know what a prince of love ought to be. To love I ought to be said If you want to call me baby let's Go ahead now What do you do? Like to tell me maybe let's Go ahead now What do you do? Want to buy me flowers let's Go ahead now What do you do? Like to tuck the hours Go ahead now Just go ahead now, when deep you I like to tell me maybe Just go ahead now, when deep you I want to buy me flowers Just go ahead now, when deep you I like to talk for hours Just go ahead now, when deep you want to call me baby If you'd like to tell me maybe baby. If you wanna, if you wanna buy me flowers Baby, you want to talk to Alice Oh, your majesty Go on, forget the king and marry me Come on, come on Go ahead now, go ahead now, baby Go ahead now Ladies 
and gentlemen, the Klipsch, Sweet Relief, COVID-19 Fun. My name is Chris Barron. You can watch me every Thursday night on stages.com for the Chris Barron Thirsty Thursday Happy Hour. Our last performance of the night is from Houndmouth, uh, seriously one of the most beloved uh, indie Americana blues acts of the last 10 years. Uh, they're fellow Hoosiers from the Klipsch headquarters state of Indiana, and they are so kind, so awesome to let us into their space to entertain us. They're here to help raise funds for their fellow musicians, plus they sound really great on Klipsch speakers. Enjoy Houndmouth. Uh, we're Houndmouth. Uh, we're coming at you from New Albany, Indiana. <laughs> <laughs> those vibes up everybody. Hey guys, we're Hal Mouth, and we're in cahoots with Klipsch's Keepers of the Sound program. They're going to be matching donations for Sweet Relief's COVID-19 fund. So keep um, artists and musicians in mind because uh, there's, there's a lot more than you realize and, uh, and everybody needs your help. Yeah. 
Cause you always walk on You swore you stick around Never drink with me But you never drink on Hi everyone, thank you for joining us. We here at Sweet Relief Musicians Fund have been receiving thousands of applications for financial assistance for musicians and music industry workers whose lives are being drastically affected by COVID-19. Your generous donations help pay for vital medical and living expenses for these individuals. Please join us at sweetrelief.org to see how you can help those in your community today. Thank you for your support. I'd like to thank you all for watching tonight. It's been an incredible experience. We're very excited to have hosted the Klipsch Keepers of the Sound experience. Remember, we're here tonight not just to enjoy the art and the music, but to really help raise money for the musicians and the mu music industry workers that are really suffering right now. If you're able to donate, please give anything you can. Klipsch will be matching your donations. Go to klipsch.com backslash sweet relief. These musicians and the music industry workers, they were the first to be hit, and they're gonna be some of the last to find relief. And we need their music, we need their efforts in our life. So thank you all for watching tonight. Stay safe, stay healthy, and keep rocking.
Testing one, two. Two turntables and a microphone. It's been two months since my last confession. <laughs> well, the thing is, I play F1, which is a pretty big stick. Yeah, right. But next to Kenny's, it looks small. <laughs> Yesterday, I kept saying clips.com backslash sweetleaf. All I could think of was Black Sabbath. <laughs> thank you. Uh, I said thank you. I can't hear anybody. I'm, I hope someone applauded. <laughs>